With the drought impacting families all over Kern County, local organizations are doing what they can to help out. 23 ABC's Lauren Etlinger is live tonight in Arvin where they are holding a drought emergency food distribution. Lauren? Todd and Jackie, I'm here at the Veterans Service Center in Arvin, where CAPK is distributing food to people that have been either underemployed or unemployed by the drought this year. But they're not only helping out the people here behind me. In fact, they're taking care of the kids this summer as well. Today kicked off the Community Action Partnership of Kern's annual Summer Food Service Program. And kids 18 and younger have plenty to look forward to. Eating and talking. And the peanut butter and jelly salad, you're going to like that. We're just hanging out with my friends and going to do some awesome things. Huh? Organizers say Bakersfield is ranked as the second hungriest city in America in terms of the ability to afford food. And this program ensures that all these kids are being fed properly year round. The school sites are not providing the free meals to the children in the community. So this really um, provides a service where the kids can come down and get this free breakfast and lunch. And this program isn't just making sure these kids get fed, they're making sure they get proper nutrients like fresh fruits and vegetables. 13 year old Jalen Williams and his mother are no stranger to Cap K's program. He used to attend as a kid and now decided to give back. Just, just to see how I was when I was a kid, when I first came here, when I was little running around just like them, it made me feel really good. Nearly 100 kids were fed today, but every year Cap K serves almost 100,000 meals to children in need, giving them something to do when school is out. We Now that summer food service program is going on until July 25th and again that's for all kids 18 years of age or younger and that takes place at the Friendship House Community Center. But back here in Arvin you still have time to head over to this food distribution. Here's a look at one box. This feeds an entire family of four for five whole days. We have some oats, rice, soup, carrots, peanut butter, pinto beans and they're even distributing fresh produce right behind me, fruits, vegetables and even water to help out with the drought. And again this event is going on until 7 o'clock this evening. For more information on upcoming events with food distribution, log on to our website, turn to 23.com. Back to you.